Hey everyone, it's Babyless Scout Julie. Today I'm gonna to show you how to install the Graco Forever all-in-one convertible car seat. This one car seat can take you from birth all the way up to a really big kid. It starts out as a rear-facing seat that can be used when your baby is as little as four pounds. When your toddler weighs 22 to 65 pounds, they can sit forward-facing. And finally, it can convert into a high-back booster and then to a backless booster that pairs with your car's seatbelt until your child is up to 120 pounds. That's one versatile car seat. All right, Julie, stop talking, let's get to it. The Forever comes with the option to use your car's latch system to install the seat. There are two clips that will hook into your vehicle's lower latch anchors, which are a pair of U-shaped metal bars hidden in the back seat cracks and a tether anchor in the rear window shelf or on seat back for forward facing installations. You definitely wanna check your vehicle owner's manual to figure out where the latch system is in your car. To install rear facing, you would have the latch strap through the blue rear facing belt path. You wanna start with the left anchor first. To attach them into the metal bar in the seat, press them on the metal bar until you hear a click. Then do the same on the right side. To tighten the seat, you can loop the adjustment strap through the slot on the side in the front of the seat without having to remove the cover. This helps get the car seat in the tightest fit rather than pulling outward on the strap. The Simply Safe Adjust Harness System and 10 position headrest lets you adjust the harness and the headrest together with no re-threading for a proper fit for your child. To loosen the harness, you simply press down on the button under this seat flap and pull down on the straps. To tighten, you pull the belt in the front. Everything is color-coded and easy to understand. There are six different recline positions. Three for the rear-facing position, two for the forward-facing position, and one for booster position. A level indicator bubble shows if it's installed in an acceptable recline position. For forward facing, you switch the latch strap through the orange forward facing belt path. Then attach the latch clips into the metal bars in the back of the seat. And like rear facing, you can loop that adjustment strap through the car seat cover and car seat to get better leverage on a tight fit. There's an additional strap with a clip in the back of the Forever that connects to the vehicle's tether anchor, which can be found behind the vehicle seat. Here I go again. Check your vehicle owner's manual to figure out where the tether anchor is located in your car. When your child is ready to use the actual seat belt rather than the harness, you just adjust the height and tuck the harness in. Unsnap the seat cover, which gives access to the storage compartment, which can store the buckle tongues, chest clip, and pads and flip down the cushion to reveal the other storage compartment for the buckle and the base. You just snap it back up, it's that easy. Then you feed the shoulder belt through the red shoulder belt guide and buckle it in. All right, let's convert this bad boy into a backless booster. First, make sure it's reclined to the booster position, number six on the dial. Then remove the harness from the slitter plate, turn the car seat around and unsnap the seat pad. Underneath, you will find two red tabs. Just lift them up, Move them in towards the center, and you remove the back of the seat. Then close the tabs, make sure you've secured the splitter plate, snap the cover back on, and there you have a booster seat. You should note that you can only use the latch system up to 45 pounds, roughly around five years old. At that point, you'll store away the latch belts and clips, and you'll switch over to the seat belt and tether installation. Also, you should know that the Forever does not have seat belt lock off. So you want to check your car's manual to figure out how the seat belt locks so that you can be sure that it's safely and securely installed with that seat belt. I really hope this guide is helpful in the installation process of this all-in-one car seat. Remember before installing the Graco Forever to check your car seat manual as well as your vehicle manual for complete instructions and information. Here is to safe and comfortable travel.